We've been working on a new learning and teaching strategy for the last few months with a focus on increasing a sense of community and working with our students as partners. The strategy has four main themes. The first one is curriculum review to create space um, and to go beyond just deep disciplinary learning. The second is introducing new, much more interactive pedagogy, so students and teachers have a different way of working together in the classroom. The third th theme is um, increasing diversity and inclusivity, to make sure that students' different backgrounds in terms of gender and ethnicity actually are an asset. And the fourth theme is to work more with online and digital technology, to scaffold our strategy with new, innovative, technology um, and we're ready to go and I hope the whole college is. So a really important part of the new learning and teaching strategy is the curriculum review stage and that gives us a chance to not just update the curricula but also to make space for some real innovation in teaching and to make space for the students to do some great quality learning. The strategy really emphasises interactive learning and this is a wonderful opportunity for us teachers to envisage our class as an interactive facilitative space rather than one in which we deliver didactic content. Creativity is the highest order thinking skill and this is a chance to facilitate creativity in our students as well as for ourselves. So having an imaginative classroom with lots of engaging activities is hugely stimulating for us teachers as well as for learners. So it's a chance to reconceptualize our thinking and to perhaps surround ourselves by engaging, inspiring people that can really help to bring a classroom setting to life. I see the strategy as a great opportunity to have permission to be creative and to facilitate learning in whole new ways. So as a recent student, I'm personally very excited by the strategy for two reasons. Firstly, it's going to allow us to build community across the university, not only physically, but also digitally. As well as this, it's going to allow us to foster a culture which embodies inclusivity and diversity. I was very fortunate to come from a department that created an inclusive and diverse community. However, I know that this is not the case across the rest of the university. The strategy is going to allow us to work together to have an oversight of community across the institution. So we're introducing digital technologies into our curriculum by incorporating pre-learning material for students that they can revise before coming to class so they can read text, they can look at images, they can watch videos showing experimental techniques. Uh, all of this can be done in their own time, in their own speed and so they can work at their own pace, they can work individually or they can work in groups. So it's really uh, appropriate for students from all sorts of different levels of abilities and who want to work under different uh, learning conditions.